Hello, this is Chris from Raven's World. I'm going to be discussing and showing the uh, Nerf 2.0 Trailblazer pistols. This is one of them. I painted it. Obviously, it comes normally blue. Um, and uh, if I can get holstered, I have two of them. You know, they could be very useful. Um, I... If you guys notice, I love the copper brass with the um, gun gunmetal color. Um, really nice. Anyway, um, I love the hammer um, primer on it. It's really cool. Fits really well in the hand, not too heavy. Um, I love the chamber. You know, where you can put the bullets, it's a shame it's the kind that you can't, like, um, pop out and, like, load from the back. That would have been really cool. Um, the other thing I would have done differently, probably, is I probably would have made the cylinder a little smaller, kind of like the, um, there's a, on Frontline Foam, there's a pistol called the Viper. And, uh, the new, um, Adventure Force, um, pistol, I believe... You can pop out the, the cylinder and pop a new one in, you know, fully loaded you know, for rapid um, uh, firing, um, quick firing. Um, that's what I probably would have done. Um, you know, uh, I've seen some people in other um, revolver pistols. I don't think I would do it, but where they would um, maybe cut out over here. Which I don't think there's enough room, uh, so they can load it from the back. But um, there was hammer shot. Hammer shot was the one that I've seen people do it on, um, and I tried it once on one of mine, and um, it was okay. I, I wasn't, you know, um, I didn't like that defacing it like that too much. It didn't quite work the way I thought I it would. But um, this was also. Um, these are also hand painted. Um, I obviously from the back mess. I haven't gotten my airbrush kit, you know, ready. But um, you can obviously put something here. I probably say, um, well, you could probably put a laser sight, but I don't know how accurate it would be. But um, you can put like a flashlight thingy, um, so you can, you know, if you're playing at night, I mean, you can illuminate the area. Um, I just love the, having the dual wheel like this. If I could get my get some holsters put in, this would look really cool, um, you know, in a, in, a, in, a, in a battle. Like if I just want to go pistol-wise, you know, and it'd be really cool. Um, you know, uh, like I said, I love the color combination. I, you know, I, I branch out a little bit more with different colors. It's just that I thought it would look really good this way, um, and um, eventually I will do a um, firing video of, of it, you know. Um, I guess the other thing I'm wondering about is why they have it filled in here, but not here. It's not like this cylinder pops out. It, it doesn't, um, so that's a little weird, um, but, you know, if you're dual wielding it, you know, it's, well, it's going to be on the wrong side anyway, no matter what you do, but still, I, I, I don't get it, but it's okay, I still like it anyway, you know, and, um, I think it'd be fun in, in a nerf battle, you know, um, you know, eventually, you know, um, See what it, see what uh, upgrading the innards, um, you know, with the spring or or whatever is in there um, to make it shoot even better. Um, it shoots decent, but you know, obviously, like everything else, it, it, you know, everything could always be improved. You know, um, you know, I, I um, you know, it's it's inexpensive. I think this these were like um, fifteen. I think not I might not be giving accurate, but it was cheap enough where I was able to get two. So um, you know, so that that 
you know, was why I did it, because I saw the, ha the hammering. I hate the ones, not hate, but i not as fond of the ones that you have to go like that, and then each time, but with this, you know, you can do, you can cock it back, fire, cock it back, fire, you can do it faster. Um, you know, it's, um, it's one of their, one of their better revolvers, you know, coming out. I like, you know, I like the revolvers. I like, you know, you know, I would automatic pistols, you know, um, that you can load the clip in, you know, from the bottom, like a traditional, uh, um, pistol would, uh, blaster would be, you know, um, and, um, you know, I just think it's, a uh, you know, pretty good, you know, design, some very good functionality. I think it's, uh, um, very worth getting and then, you know, modding. Um, I'm sure there's things that I, we can still add to this to make it look even cooler. Um, you know, so far I, I just been leaving it alone and, um, you know, just basically, uh, just painting it right for the, for the moment and decide later on what I'm going to do. Um, I hope that, uh, you end up, uh, enjoying this. Um, really not a whole lot to say about it. Um, but it's about, you know, it's just very simple in its use. Um, uh, I would love to see if, if anybody that has these things, what your paint design is and what you might do to, to mod it like cosmetically, you know, on the outside. I would love ideas. And then, and if you don't mind, I would love, you know, stealing some of the ideas, if, um, if I end up liking it. So, um, I hope that you guys enjoy it. I hope that, um, you go out and get it. And, um, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Um, I have many more to still do and more, many more blasts to still get. So I hope you enjoy it and I hope you subscribe, like the videos, and also please, um, view as many as you can. Thank you. Take care.